Let's prove that bisectors of corresponding angles in a pair of parallel lines are also parallel. Here is our figure and in this figure PQ is parallel to RS, BE and CG are bisectors of angle ABQ and angle BCS. We have to prove that BE is parallel to CG. Since BE is the bisector of angle ABQ, that means angle ABE is equal to angle EBQ. And here, since CG is the bisector of angle BCS, that means angle BCG is equal to angle GCS. Let's model the proof using a set of straws. In the first arrangement of straws, the green straws are parallel and the red straws are placed in such a way that red straws bisect the corresponding angles. That means this angle is equal to this angle and this angle is equal to this angle. We can ourselves see that when the red straws are the bisectors of the corresponding angles, then they are parallel. In the second arrangement of straws, we can see green straws are parallel as in the previous case. This red straw is the bisector of this angle, but this red straw is not the bisector of this angle. And we can ourselves see that red straws in this case are not parallel. So from here, we can see that when the red straws are the bisectors of the corresponding angles, they are parallel. But in the second case, when the red straws are not the bisectors of the corresponding angles, they are not parallel. Coming back to our original figure, let's discuss the approach we will take in proving BE parallel to CG. To make the approach more clear, let us extend BE to this side. And similarly, we will extend CG also. Now we know that lines PQ and RS are parallel, so corresponding angles ABQ and BCS will be equal. Since these angles are equal, their halves will also be equal. This means that angle ABE will be equal to angle BCG, as BE and CG are the bisectors. So what we are trying to say here is that this angle is equal to this angle. If we take BE and CG as the pair of lines, and AD as the transversal, then these two angles are the corresponding angles and these two angles are equal. So by converse of corresponding angle axiom, we can say that BE is parallel to CG. We have extended lines BE and CG so that it becomes more clear to us that when BE and CG are the pair of lines, then AD is the transversal. So here we can write that angle ABQ, that means this angle, is equal to angle BCS. Because these are corresponding angles, this implies that half of angle ABQ will be equal to half of angle BCS and this implies half of angle ABQ will be since BE is the bisector half will be angle ABE is equal to half of BCS will be since CG is the bisector half will be angle BCG So if we consider BE and CG as the pair of lines and AD as transversal, angle ABE and BCG are corresponding angles. Therefore, 
BE is parallel to CG by converse of corresponding angle axiom. Let's summarize what we have learned by solving this problem. We model the problem in terms of a pair of parallel lines and transversal. We also learned how axioms and theorems are applied in proofs.